Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Corey from Corey's Tech Time, and today we are revisiting the Nokia T20 tablet. So I've been having this for nearly two years now, and this device has not aged well at all. And I believe this is due to it recently or not so recently receiving Android 12. So when this device launched, it launched with Android 11 and things worked pretty well. It was pretty consistent. It was able to hold apps in the background, um, but ever since this device received Android 12, it has not performed well at all. It can't hold apps in the background. Uh, the animations are pretty much gone. Um, and it seems like the CPU is just not really capable of running uh, this new version of Android or Nokia did not really optimize the software well enough to run on Android 12. So um, it's very similar in terms of like the look. Um, when you get into like say some of the widgets, that's where you can tell that there's material you um, on this device with the Android 12. It's not in many areas. Um, they really um, did not really ad adapt the software to take advantage of all the places where Google applied the material you and that's this tablet is not optimized well for uh, it's not optimized well for tablets at all so that's like another ding against it so but yeah I mean they have some colors they have some wallpaper colors but not not nowhere near nearly as extensive as what you will find on your pixel um, but yeah, I mean, as far as like the basics that this thing can do, it can stream YouTube. Um, it can stream maybe some other apps. Um, outside of that, I mean, I would definitely would not video edit with this. I tried to video edit with LumaFusion using this device. It loads, but I mean, it's so choppy, it's not even usable. Um, it performs a little bit better with CapCut. So if you're gonna use this device to edit, use CapCut. Outside of that, I mean, with this tablet not being optimized for um, just tablet software, um, it's really a hard suggest for me right now. Um, I would recommend maybe looking at a Lenovo that's running maybe something with 12L or Samsung. Samsung definitely updates their tablets and their newer tablets um, all run Android 13. So, so yeah, I mean, this device, I, mean, I hate to say it, it, it just didn't age well at all. And this was with one major update. You do get monthly updates um, and those are somewhat consistent, but again, that's not enough uh, for me to recommend. Um, this device is supposed to get Android 13, but if it, if it runs this poorly with Android 12, I, would, I definitely would not recommend it. So again, this is just a quick look at the Nokia T20. I definitely, do not recommend buying unless you can get it with Android 11, which is probably not possible anymore. Uh, but just avoid it. Look at Samsung, look at maybe Lenovo if you're into Android tablets. Uh, so that's it for this one. Questions, comments, feel free to leave those. And until the next one, peace.